as the two teams wait in the tunnel. Captain Mihai Makove for Romania, earning a 101st cap, while Vladimir Popper is the man handed the key to the 10 shirt. No, Romania ranked 19th in the world against Poland, who are ranked 30th. Romania with the World Cup on the horizon. Well, yes. 2023 Rugby Europe Championship is underway. Romania against these new kids on the block in Poland. Well picked up by Jorge Gajon. Now, little ball back inside. Oh, that's worked out nicely. Then the offload. Is there going to be anyone stopping Marius Simeonescu? The answer is no. A seventh try for his country and they've already opened the Polish up. And what a way to begin the action here in the Arc de Triumph. What a thing of beauty that was. Wing play aligning, sheer power coming through the middle initially. This inside ball, a little bit of magic out wide. Very enjoyable. What a start for the Romanians. In from Tigla. Oh, it's a huge shove and the control at the back. There's no one going to be stopping Christy Kirika from that sort of range. Big man manages to get the try. And all too easy, nice control at the back. Gets it over, but that is a front row thing of beauty to witness. They will be loving it, the Romanians. Kontinak and Septar working well, and then it's Simeonescu, and they've got men on the outside. The ball had to go, it will go from Kirika onto Butnariu. And the hooker will score his second try for Romania. And of course, if you mentioned outside channel, it will be featuring this man, Simeonescu. He is everywhere. Nice support place. Difficult skill to take the ball this close to the defensive line. This little dummy pump here just buys in that last defender. A nice link play from the number eight, Jurice, who. Vavasa certainly getting himself involved since he's come on. Now, is it just going to open up? Oh, it's electric. Oh, just stopped short. Chance to finish it under the post. It will be a second for Christy Kirikup. Great footwork, just chopped down short. Palpai couldn't quite get there. And like any good number eight, is comfortable with a range of skills, be it taking that ball up. The link play we saw in the previous try. And now Kirikup gets over himself. Hudson waiting on the left. Get him up, get him up. Wants to try and straighten, manages to find Vitovic. Ooh. And then they step round and Vitovic manages to get it infield and it's brilliant work through the hands. And Peter Hudson is going to finish it off and Poland get themselves onto the score sheet. Superb. But that is a big carry. And then alongside, as any good outside centre should be, Hudson in the slipstream. And he is loving the wind. Makove at the tail once more, straight down for Tigla and through Popa. Balvasa managing to make it work again in that midfield. He's been a real menace since he's come on there, and this is a weave amazing run to take Romania to within two metres and then the pick and go. Poland offside, but the try scored regardless. It might have been Gajon who managed to roll over, and that is a front rower's effort. Maybe you see one. What a frame! Huge what human. He gets that initial collision and whirls over. It's the it's he way to span there. So he got hit with his back and then rolled over with his right hand. I mean, he's like a bouncer, isn't he? Just looking for that slightly shorter ball from Gontinak onto Valvasa, but. Poland were equal to defend it at that point, but now they're going to use the physicality and come through, come Septar. So difficult to stop. Hudson trying to effect the defence, but the ball is grounded as they go through the contact. And it's Taylor Gontinak who's got it. He got it, quite how he put the ball down. I can't quite work that out yet. Rode that collision as it looked like he was heading towards the touchline, put the right paw down, and then he gets over, takes on Hudson, one on one. As he's getting barreled, the ball ends up a metre away from where he gets dumped. What a finish. There's his rugby at Ebbe Vale. And there's another penalty advantage here. 
Hudson. Knew he was under penalty advantage. Rob Vickerman, I can see a frown on your face. Well, just contextually, I'm not quite sure why you'd take the three points here. You're 38-7 down, you're in front of the sticks, you can go for a scrum, which you'd like to think you could secure. It's grade A possession. I'm not quite sure what three more points is at this stage, but either way, they've taken them. Well, what it does do is put them into double figures, Poland, at the end of the first half. In Bucharest gives us a half-time score of the Rugby Europe Championship. Romania 38, Poland 10. Very comfortable position to be in. I think Poland just need to fire a few more shots. Said first half, they look good when they challenge. They just need to do it more. Bounces off the right foot. Valvasa, just a gentle offload. His pass selection is an absolute delight. Real selection, box of skills. Another one back inside and then the finish. And is it that man, Valvasa, who's managed to get over? It is. Of course it is, Hinkley Valvasa. He looks effortless when he's playing rugby. He's picking the right balls. He's looking with so much precision. Missed the autumn series, but then it's the leg drive from Jorge Gajon. They've still got the advantage here and they've got the numbers queuing up in the wide channels. Offering it to each other to score the try and dot it down. Mihai Makovei was very happy to offer it to Paul Papuaya to get over for the score. It brings up the 50. Wonderful generosity in the goal area, but it goes all the way back to that scrum, back when Poland were on the upper hand. That was a great defensive play, lovely attacking rugby. Tackle release. Cieslinski. And presenting himself, really good physical position from Jan Sal. Then it's there again for Zeshitek and the offload this time and they drive to the line and it looks like they're over. Poland get their second try and it's come the way of Thomas Fiddler. His second for his country. And that will do nicely. Too big, too strong. And he's over the line, Fiddler. Another change has been made for Romania. They. Uh, Got a couple of subs left, and it's the debutant scrum half, 20-year-old Alan Konake, who is on. But now this is the weaving running. Oh, that is sensational. It's nothing less than he deserves, Taylor Gontinak. In behind, and then the line in sight. Lovely footwork as well to get round the last man. That is outstanding centre play. Chislinski, who's come off the bench and certainly done a decent few carries when called upon. Now they go for the crossfield kick effort. Gonna beat everybody, but uh, Ali Fanua was the one who had an eye on it. They've been out there waiting for a while. Ali Fanua. The Polish just not looking like they've got that extra gear. To get all game. Get his tally up to 10 points. Poland up to 20. Valvasa looking to get his hands on it. Then it's come away. Is it going to be the score for the replacement? Yes, it is. Irimescu going over for Romania on his debut. The New York United hooker. What a moment that is for him. Free with the offload and the big men celebrating it. Cracking rugby from Romania. Eyeing up try number 11, Valvasa. Oh, it's an absolute beauty over the top. The man's got it all. Try number 11 does come in for Romania. Gets the ball five metres out, checks up. Doesn't even know who's out there, but he just sends it. Left hand, 25 metre pass. Hinkley Balbasa just stop it. That is delightful. Timichuk to keep it alive. Into the final two minutes. Oh, and the intercept has been really well affected. Quick look over the shoulder to see if there's going to be any support or if he's got to go all the way himself. It will be the score. Thomas Pozniak on debut. The youngster for Poland gets over for the score.
There is so much to enjoy about this. The audacity to try and pick up Valvassa's ball on the inside. He gets it, and then almost in shock, the 17-year-old debutant checks over his shoulder, no less than twice, thinking, what is this freedom I've found? Well, just as I say that, it's going to be Wojciech Petrovic, the man who scored the last point, who will clear the ball into touch. Romania off to the start they will have wanted in the 2023 Rugby Europe Championship, beating Poland by 67 points to 27.